Hi, my name is Sam Dhaneshekran and welcome to this series of database lessons. In this video, we will talk about what is uh, RDBMS. Like, some people might uh, uh, wonder uh, if it's a, if this is going to be a database lesson, why this video is in the first video, right? So, years ago when I learned uh, uh, RDBMS, the on the very first day the first uh, slide was uh, what is uh, rdbms and then uh, i was explained that uh, rdbms is a database management system which maintains data that are related and i was like whoa how come data is related i mean i, I didn't i didn't understand so i thought uh, let me explain. So when when I started this uh, database uh, lessons series, I thought let me explain things in a particular order, but then that would not comply with the traditional order, so that uh, it would be easier for you to understand. At least it would, it was easy for me to understand when I uh, arranged the things that I learned in particular order. So I wanted to wait uh, up until. Uh, this foreign key database lesson and then I wanted to explain RDBMS so uh, this video the prerequisite for this video is uh, you would need to know what is a foreign key so you may want to uh, you, you may want to watch the, the, the previous uh, lessons video uh, the previous video which is what is a foreign key so in foreign key we talked about uh, this data right is referencing this data so meaning that the data from this column right should be a subset of this column so basically you know these are the products that are being produced and when you sell it has to be the products which are being produced you cannot sell something which is not listed here right so that's the thing so the data here is related to the data here right and the relation this uh, we, this is this, this column is like a child uh, column to this column which in the database world uh, we call it as a parent column in 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 turn we call this table as a child to this table right so a database management dbms is a database management system where uh, you have uh, data which are being managed basically you have data in different tables and everything but then again when you establish relationship between the data right like I mentioned here right then it becomes relational database relational uh, database management system that's it so uh, just remember right like I uh, explained you can sell the product which are being produced here let me give you one more example this is the the in in london uh, 2012 olympics this is the medal tally right just a snippet of a medal tally from london 2012 okay if someone looks into this okay you notice states of america they have won 104 total medals. China, 88. Great Britain, 65. United Plains of Mars. And then Germany. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. What is this? United Plains of Mars. There isn't a country like this. Does it belong to Mars? And I can safely say that no Martians has ever, no Martians have ever won Olympics. Right? So, uh, if there are any Martians watching this video, please don't get mad at me and don't land your uh, uh, saucer at my lawn in the midnight. I'll get scared. Anyway, so the point is someone entered some wrong value and that would make the entire data invalid. Right? So the model would be there would be another table which lists the country names, right, which are existent only on the earth. And then this would, not this arrow, so this would refer to that table. So that's how the relations are being maintained. 
So, and the system that maintains this kind of database is called relational database management system. And nowadays, most of the systems, the database management systems that you would see in the market are RDBMS. I would say all of the systems that you would see in the market are RDBMS. Um, except some uh, very small uh, spreadsheet applications like that. Thanks for watching this video and uh, if you have any questions please send me a comment.